Hi friend, Roxy Saran here. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today I want to introduce you to a brand new friend of ours, vanilla. And not just any vanilla, Madagascar vanilla. This is a brand new product in the doTERRA lineup. I can't wait to tell you about it today. So it's iconic, it's sweet, and it's very rare. This beautiful aroma speaks for itself. I love this pure Madagascar vanilla. It is an absolute, it's pre-diluted in a base of coconut oil, and it's ideal for diffuser blends using topically, and I love a drop in my morning coffee. And without all of the sugar, right? I'm sweet enough. Be sure to hit the subscribe and bell notification and also the like. Stick around for the amazing story of Madagascar vanilla and also top tips how to use it. All right, so the vanilla plantifolia is the species. It derives from the orchid plant. So it is native to Mexico and the Central America region, but now it's really typically grown in tropical regions all over the world globally. Well, there's one problem. You know my husband's a beekeeper, so you're gonna love this. There's a bee problem, right? Well, the natural pollination only is by this one specific type of bee that lives in Mexico. It, it, that's where the region is. So anywhere outside of Mexico, there's less than 1% chance that the flower will be pollinated on its own. Isn't this mind-blowing? Bees are so amazing and so powerful and, and what they do. so. Farmers have to actually pollinate every flower by hand. Oh my gosh, this is staggering, right? Can you imagine? Pollinating every flower by hand when it blooms. And so typically, vanilla bean only blooms, guess what? One time a year. All right, so here's the problem, right? Only blooms one time a year and it has to be pollinated on that day right when it blooms, so amazing. So very fragile and needs to be pollinated first thing in the morning by hand in the cooler hours of the day. So as you can imagine, very labor intensive. And so in this incredibly short uh, time, if not, it wilts. And so the fruit doesn't develop and then you have no vanilla bean that can be harvested later. So this beautiful labor intensive plant is one of the most expensive expensive crops after saffron. Okay, so most companies, that's why they adulterate and use a synthetic vanilla for fragrances and other flavorings because it's gonna save them time and money. And it's estimated that the majority of the vanilla flavored products don't actually contain any vanilla at all. I know, crazy, right? Go to roxysaran.com if you are ready to purchase your Madagascar vanilla oil. It will be available starting October 1st of 2021. And so go ahead and grab that right at roxysaran.com. All right, so 80% of real vanilla all comes from Madagascar. It's the perfect tropical climate to thrive and there are thousands of people that are employed in our vanilla supply chain. I love that about doTERRA, we give back to these communities. Well, the harvest is a crucial source for their economic uh, development, for the rural commu communities and also for their local economy. I love that our doTERRA Healing Hands, together with our co-impact sourcing, uh, has given back into this area. So it's a Mahadera is an agricultural training center that is wonderful and helps the harvesters and the growers in this area of Madagascar. They have a three-year training program that's gonna help train up these children and farmers, give them access to education and other opportunities to help secure a future for them and their families. I love that. That brings me so much joy knowing that you're giving back to this amazing community in Madagascar. Well, the pure Madagascar vanilla absolute, it starts with a vanilla pod, but it first has to go through a CO2 extraction, which involves grinding the beans into these little small pieces. And then it's going to actually, um, a fluid separates through it. Normally a CO2 is a gas but the special right pressure and the right temperature is gonna help separate that. Once it's separated, separated the volatile and the non-volatile components, it can be concentrated and captured. Um, so there you go, long story short, we have this amazing product. It's pure and all natural solvent, beautiful Madagascar vanilla. If you're ready to hop in with doTERRA essential oils, go to roxysaran.com. I'd love to help you right at roxysaran.com. Well, in the separator, these chemical components are separated from each other and the CO2 superficial fluid converted back into a gas 
thereby leaving the vanilla extract. It's clean and free of any solvents. After months of hard work, we have this beautiful, clean and natural alcohol solvent that is uh, used to remove any of the residual waxes and other components to create the final product, which is the pure and natural vanilla absolute. This last step really concentrates the natural vanillin. It gives vanilla its incredible aroma. Well, the CO2 extraction is definitely a cleaner process than chemical extraction. It leaves behind less residue and is greener and more sustainable. So thank you, doTERRA, always taking care of our planet as we give back as well. All right, you've stuck around to the end. Let me give you some amazing usage tips now that you know all the things about vanilla from doTERRA. Okay, so you can add a drop to your next diffuser blend and it'll help sweeten that aroma. You're gonna love it. You can add a drop on your wrist or on your throat as your personal aroma for the day. You can add a drop to your personal care product, whether it's your shampoo, conditioner, or your uh, facial creams, just one drop in there is gonna sweeten that aroma. You're gonna love it. Of course, I mentioned at the beginning, a drop in your smoothie or your tea or coffee. You're gonna love the way that tastes. And last but not least, an awesome tip for you is as you slice up some apples, put them in a cup of pure water, one drop of On Guard doTERRA's Immunity Blend, uh, protecting blend, and one drop of vanilla. Let them soak in there for a couple minutes. Then you can enjoy a little sweet treat, again, without any added sugar. I'm so glad that you're joining me today. Welcome, welcome. Help me welcome Madagascar Vanilla to the doTERRA lineup. I hope to see you in the next video. We'll be talking about the new abode line. Have a healthy day.